Hey guys, Sean Lee here. Hey, just wanted to send a quick video uh, around a concept that we've been using here in our office recently, uh, helping people make a decision on how do they want to create their income, and it's all about leverage of, of your money. Now, when we have this discussion, we have a discussion around protected money using annuities and, and secure income, or do they want to use the market and use dividends and, and create their income that way? Either way, it doesn't really matter to us, but we want to have a logical discussion around what percentages it takes to create income from the assets that they have. So I put together a, just a quick sample. Uh, we have a client who has a need of $3,000. Uh, they have $1.5 million in total assets. To give you an idea of what, what we talk about, we have a discussion on how much of your income do you really want to be protected. Now, in this example, if they wanted half of their income to be protected, it would take about $375,000 of deposit to create $1,500 per month of income, and that's going to cover 50% of their, of their income. Now what's interesting about this, 375000 of the $1.5 million is just about 18% of their net worth, give or take, and closer to 25. Now when, when we look at this, they're using 50% or 25% of their money to create 50% of their income. Now if we look at the market risk side, they now have 1.125 million, which will still need to create 50% of their income, but that's the other 75% of their assets. So thinking of leverage, say, so well, if you're going to create income, how much income or how much of your money would it take to create the full $3,000 a month income need? In that case, it would take $755,000 of deposit, which in essence they created 100% of their income from that using about 52% of their assets. So they were able to create 100% of their income using 52% of their assets, and then the remainder, we'll call it $750,000. They need 0% of their income, and that's 48% of their assets. Now what they've done is they've created 48% of their assets not required to use for income. They could go after a little bit more growth. They could use the dividends if they wanted to just by thinking about how they're going to leverage their money. And your planning, I hope this benefits you. Have a great week. All the best.